Uh, take us back through last season. You, come out, you start the first game, and then I know we heard you went through some personal things during the year, and then kind of been a strong ball practice. What was the last year like for you? Uh, it was a pretty hectic season. Uh, you know, a lot of personal things came in the, uh, in the play as far as um, you know my mindset at the time. But uh, you know, overall, it was a, a, a good and fun season, and uh, I had a great time. What were you going through and how did it affect your football loss? Uh, just a lot of family stuff. Uh, yeah, football wise, uh, just my mindset needed to be fixed a little bit and uh, talking to the coaching staff and uh, a lot of the players helped a lot. So, yeah. Can you talk about that, this last offseason compared to this and the body transformation you guys are going through? Uh, yeah, it's great, man. Uh, you see a lot of the players, uh, Amos Talalele, Emmanuel Pregnant, a lot of the players, uh, just doing great with their body weights overall, just working really hard, just getting all the bad weight off and putting on the, the good weight, all the muscle. They said the defensive line gave 350, 340 pounds as a group. Do you guys have a, a number that you guys reach? I, I don't remember. They showed us, but, uh, yeah, we're up there somewhere. I don't know if it's as much, but, uh, I think we're more on the, the losing. Got it. Yeah. What's your outlook for this year and maybe a chance to compete for a starting job? Uh, honestly, I just look forward to getting play time uh, any way I can. Uh, even if it's a little spurts, just an opportunity to get my, my uh, talent out there. Be good. Was that, that like last year, the first game, you were thrust out there as a starter? What were you thinking? Uh, it was scary. I was nervous. Uh, you know, a lot of the, a lot of the pressure. You know, I never played in front of what is that, seventy thousand people. Uh, so you know, it was a lot on my, my, in my head, especially with the plays and stuff. So uh, I feel like uh, I did pretty decent. Are you working at uh, both guard spots, or is there one you're focusing on more? Uh, I think the coach is just rotating everywhere. It's not really like a set spot. Yeah. What's the area that you improved the most from last year? Most. Oh, I just learned. Oh, hold on, my bad. I'm getting better at learning the formations. Yeah, a lot better. Who's helped you the most along the way? Uh, I wouldn't say there's like a specific person, honestly. Uh, it's really just like talking to a lot of the players. Coaches, uh, it's not all just like what you, what you guys see out here on the field. It's, uh, it's a lot of background work, you know, it's a lot of talking, personal, personal talks, and just uh, getting into the background. What are your impressions of the three freshmen that have arrived on campus? That's Lolo, Justin, and uh, Jason. They're really good. Uh, I see them doing great things over here at USC. They work hard, weight room and uh, on the field. They're really good, I can tell you that. What's Afternoon it? practices or morning practices, which do you prefer? Well, morning? I'm just saying that because I feel better today. I'll probably feel poopy next morning. Let's do one more. What was the most surprising part last year making the transition to college football? Sorry, can you repeat that? What was the most surprising part for you last year, the thing that maybe you weren't expecting as much? As uh, this year? Last year, as you made the transition to college. Oh, uh, hmm. I'd say the men's uh, like the plays and stuff. Uh, it's a lot deeper than I thought. In high school, it was just like, you know, the D linemen and the linebackers. In college, it like expands. It's like the corners and the safeties. It's, it's crazy, but I'm getting getting better at it. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Thank you, Thank you guys.